Here is Lubera Co. UK, the Swiss fruit and berry plant producers and breeders. My name is Markus Kobold, I'm founder and breeder of Lubera. Today, this evening, I want to speak to you about breeding for more flavor, for a better eating quality. As a breeding program, as breeders which are concentrated for the home fruit grower, for the home gardener, and not uh, for the professional fruit growing, we can concentrate on on the, on the quality aspects which are important for you uh, home gardeners at home. So we can concentrate to breed varieties, uh, fruit varieties, apple varieties, berry varieties, uh, raspberry varieties, gooseberry varieties, which are easier to grow, uh, which are as, as resistant as possible and which are better to eat. Uh, I'm convinced that in berries and also in top fruit, especially in apples, there are met much more flavors, much more aroma components, uh, aroma possibilities uh, that we know till now. So uh, going through the fields, uh, selecting varieties, sometimes I find something new, a new aroma. And this is the case with this uh, apple tree here, uh, some apple trees of the same a number, a uh, breeding clone of our breeding, an uh, early variety ripening now about 20th of, uh, of uh, August, so rather early. And I was the last two weeks I was eating this variety and I was very interested in the flavor, in the aroma, and I couldn't describe it. And today I had the idea, first we see the apple, uh, it's a little bit blue, at the shiny blue on, on, the, on the tree, when you are polishing it, it's becoming uh, a fine rosy and uh, I was eating today again this apple and suddenly I remarked what the flame, what the aroma is. Uh, it, this aroma is remembering me to childhood. To childhood as a child when you were, were uh, buying these uh, sweet things which are very sweet and very acid and you, you can't become enough of it. You, you are buying and buying again, you are eating and eating again, and you want to have it. They are fruity, they are very sweet, they are very acid, and you can't have enough of it. And this apple is the same aroma, the same flavor, and it's really remembering me uh, to childhood. And what is also very interesting, when you are cutting this apple, which is not part of our red loft breeding program, so non-red flesh breeding, in most apples, here for example, you have a little bit rosy, rosy shine in the apple. Sometimes it's more. For example, if we are cutting this one. So here, you see it better. So you have a rosy shine in the apple. Very nice. And we have this mm, special aroma with extremely high acidity, extremely high sugar which is remembering me to childhood to these sweet things. You can't have enough of it. So my working title of this variety is uh, Fruity Rosy. So we will see, perhaps in some year you can buy it uh, at Sutton's, at Lovera's. and uh, will be part of our home garden program because it's something special. And in the home gardening program we can, we can multiply some varieties which are, which are very special, which are, uh, will find friends in, in home gardening because they are different and this one is real different in aroma and in the aspect and the color of the fruit flesh but especially in aroma. Thank you very much. Discuss with us about uh, what are you thinking about flavor, about flavors in berries and in apples. What do you miss? What do you want to find in apples and berries? Discuss with us. As always, don't believe everything I'm telling you and go on gardening.